Hello, this is Karen Wood from the University of Maryland Extension, Garrett County 4-H, and today I'm going to show you how to make a paper circuit lightning bug. We will start by tracing and cutting out the parts of our lightning bug. We will begin with the head. Lightning bugs are also called fireflies and are not actually flies at all. They are part of the beetle family. We will move on to the abdomen. The last segment of the abdomen lights up, flashing bright. This is because of a chemical reaction most have called bioluminescence, meaning the ability to produce light. Now we will make two sets of wings. Like all other beetles, they have hardened forewings. Lightning bugs use the forewings for balance while in flight. There are more than 2,000 different species of lightning bugs, and each has its own unique sequence of patterns, colors, and lights that fill the night sky. They are mostly seen on warm, humid summer nights, and they're nocturnal, meaning they're active at night. Now we're going to piece together the lightning bug with some tape. I just take a small circle of tape and attach the wings and head to the abdomen. Next, we're going to add the antennas. I am using half of a pipe cleaner, about six inches, to attach to the top of the head. Now we will add a hole punch to the bottom of the lightning bug for its light. Time to create a path for our electricity to flow through the circuit. We will use copper conductive tape to connect each part of the circuit. Peel just a few inches of tape at a time as it is fragile and tears pretty easily. Leave an extra inch or so on the positive side of the circuit. This will connect to the battery later. The LED has two wires. Notice one is longer. That is the positive side, and the shorter side is negative. We will connect the battery to make sure that both the battery and the LED are working properly before we attach them to our project. To allow the LED to fit properly, you will need to bend the wire, also known as legs, to be flat. Be careful not to bend the legs numerous times as they will break. Tape the LED with a small piece of conductive tape to be sure you have a strong connection. Okay. 
Add the battery with the positive side facing up and the negative side facing down on the conductive tape. Be sure to tape just a bit over each side of the battery. If you tape over the entire battery, the tape will act as an insulator and stop the circuit from making a connection. Finally, you can add a little paper switch that can be attached to the extra tape covering the battery to light it up. And there you have it, a paper circuit lightning bug. Have fun!